You do have don't, the scars. Don't let somebody trick you. That's true. Uh, welcome to Trailer Trash. This is the show where we watch trailers and we get trashed and we trash the trailers. And sometimes we are trash. I'm always trash. That's very obvious by my constant need for attention. Uh, so what the fuck are we watching today? I believe it's a movie called Pray for the Devil. Pray for the Devil. Pray with an E. You see how clever it is? Whoa. I can see the pitch meeting already. It's called Pray for the Devil, but it's an E. So really it means like people the devil are going to pray on and it, like, it gets you here and it's just going to fuck with people's melon. Oh, so it's one of those pumes. Wait, isn't Pray yeah. on an air conditioner's? No! <laughs> That's Freon. Uh, <laughs> I don't care what it is, it's delicious. Exactly. Uh, it's got Virginia Madsen. Is that Michael Madsen's wife or some shit? I've got fucking no idea. That does not look like Virginia Madsen to me. No, that's a black man. Anyway, we're just going to end up watching this thing and seeing exactly how it goes. Uh, and uh, so let's roll that uh, beautiful bean footage. Bean? Just bean. It's a bean. It's a thing. Let's to the mouth of hell, shall we? Oh, uh, Roman Polanski's house, the mouth of hell. That's yeah. I gotta get him in every one. Hey, you ain't gonna get none. <laughs> I think they bang keys or something, don't they? Uh, that was a hemorrhoid pillow. <laughs> that was like a puckered butthole pillow. That's true. Uh, and then there were none. I, I don't know. She's I not. hope the devil doesn't come out of that door. <laughs> I don't Thank God this plywood door can hold it back. Well, the devil, you have. there's always a little hook on the door. You have to let the devil out. You see that Twilight Zone episode? Yeah. You should. Uh, it's a much better than this movie's going to be. Well, I think this movie's going to be excellent. Uh, there's the a Howling Man. There's the next episode of the Twilight Zone. It's a school of exorcism. I don't understand why women are allowed in it, but at the same time, I don't understand why women are allowed in any school. <laughs> oh, they're all looking at her and judging her for being there. They didn't want her. true. Have you noticed your hat is green? <laughs> and I wonder how aggressive that might or might not. It is like peak puke. Peak puke green. Oh, she's back in the habit. These are all the nun jokes I have. She's probably going to puke green. Oh, she's climbing up walls. What is the actual real world exorcism that defined all these rules? It's just the uh, exorcism. Yeah, we'll see. So she climbs these walls and then jumps down, but not on top of a person. So why are they this demon that doesn't actually try to hurt anyone? What's a nice demon? Oh my she god! Swallow her hair. What's that disease where you want to swallow your hair and you end up with those? Uh, I have it. <laughs> you end up with like the every day. I think they're called beezors. Oh, uh, it's Nicholas Cage disease. Beezors. It's personal. This church has a lot of surveillance. Been waiting for you. Do you want to play a game? That's the saw guy, right? I have no idea. Your mother has a pretty voice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's no. been a long time since Oh, it is an electrical <laughs> automatic door. I'm gonna come! <laughs> That's why. That's the White House now. She likes children. The devil. She's preggers! This is what happens when you allow uh, Christianity into government. Hey, it's in the White House. Hey, preggers can't be choosers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, the same happens to my plants when I forget to water them. They look the same way. You have to water them? Plants? Yes! God damn it! Pray! Pray! Pray for the devil! Um, what a thrilling type film. God, it takes itself deadly seriously. But I love these like religious horror films with the nuns and what do you think? I've already seen one good movie with Prey in it this year. Okay, but that's this year. <laughs> and it was pretty good, that's true. Uh, um, now, so I think the problem is um, I have not seen The Nun or most of... They're not related. <laughs> I have not seen The Nun. I have not seen most of the modern... Um, Conjuring films. With they're them. still not related. I know they're not, but they're all so bad. The Nun is bad, <laughs> but the first Conjuring, the oh, yeah. second Conjuring, yeah. like the second or third Annabelle is pretty good. Same. Right, they are. It's but the, the second the ones, Annabelle, the ones I'm being told by my producer. Third one's the babysitting one. That's good too. Most of the Annabelles are fine. The first one's like was the most disappointing, which is shocking. They made another one, but they were all better than Dead Silence. So there's that. I'm just going to say my problem. But not, the worst one, Curse of La La Rona. Yeah, I also saw, La someone, La I saw someone watching that. I was like, why? But La the, La 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 Rona. All right. 
<laughs> Good luck. Yeah. No, you have to put your hands on the throat to kill him. Yeah, do it again. <laughs> no, it's an exorcism style. I'm gonna come! <laughs> so, no, my problem with these movies is they're all, they're all, first of all, they're all the same. The ones that only focus on their religion are bad. Like it's like I'm a religious person here for exorcism. It's terrible. If that if they wanted serious things, that little girl would have jumped down and like ripped some heads off. That would have been awesome. She might. They might not show she that didn't. in the trailer. Well, they don't show that in the trailer necessarily. Yes, not necessarily. Well, they should. So she probably does at least wound someone. It's behind the near fatally face. wounded. The most <laughs> the most fatal wound I saw was some chick giving birth to the devil. Well, maybe if they give. There are a very proud tradition of, of people giving birth to the devil. That was a big 70s trope. So I'm, I'm kind of looking forward to it because I've seen a lot of great 70s movies about nuns. They're called nun exploitation movies and they, they're they mostly topless. And Sometimes they're very, they fly. They're very good art. Oh, there is that one flying nun. That's true. <laughs> oh, that one nun flew and now every nun's got to fly. Every flew. nun's got to fly. Yeah. Exactly. CNN's going to be warning us about the nun flu breaking out next season. What do you want? I just want you to say we're having none of it. <laughs> we're having none of it. I... <laughs> Oh my god, there's so much going on. Anyway, are you going to see this movie? I'm in it for you, not for you. Uh, no, I'm not going to watch this movie, unfortunately, but I will read the novelization. Ah, very good. <laughs> it's a graphic serialization. It's going to be... It's going to be very graphic. <laughs> very, very graphic. And that's all the time we have for Trailer Trash, and we'll see you fucking next time. Oh my god, woman. <laughs>